which is really too bad because my funny stuff is coming up next, so you'll have to come back next time. I can't wait to introduce our next comic. Letterman, Lennon, uh, Leno, maybe Lennon, uh, Conan, he's watched all of those. Please welcome to the stage, DJ Payne. Um, yeah, so as Ron said, my name is DJ Payne, like disc jockey, but I don't. And uh, pretty funny people, you know, when I was younger, uh, well, not younger, actually, a fetus in my mother's womb, uh, people would give suggested names for what people could call me. A bunch of all-star suggestions like Ima or Window Payne. Uh, my personal favorite was Royal, and then I like to combine them together. So first name Ima, middle name Royal, last name Payne, you can call me Royal. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty funny. People always ask me, like, where do you DJ at? And I get so sick of hearing it that I like to tell them um, Sunday night at Cruising 7 on Central. What I don't tell them is it's a gay bar, and that's training night. So, uh, you know, the worst thing is when they actually, like, know, and then they want to go with you. Uh, yeah, so, um, speaking of awkward situations, I uh, recently had to get a colonoscopy. It's fun times. I'm sure if you grew up that with that. To do that, you have to go to get some stuff to like clear yourself out. So you have to go out in public and sort of admit that this is happening. And I went to the store at CVS, and uh, you probably shouldn't smoke weed before you go do awkward things. And the guy sort of like smelled it on me or something, and he's like, "I just want to pay and stream like this and get in and get out, clean out, be good." And he's over here telling me how like, "Oh man, that smells so good." But, on my break, I like to longboard through the park and smoke joints. And I don't care about your joints. Like, put the phone away. We're not putting selfies on social media right now. I stop. Like, the next thing's the demo. Trust me, I don't need that. Um, so then I go up to pay, and uh, you know they have those new chip credit card machine things where it, they're confusing. So I sort of view them like women, and uh, it's weird because you have to stick it in, but. Then you have to answer all these questions and push all these buttons in the correct order. And if you pull an option soon, you have to stick it in again and start all over. And then it's like, you get like, eh, transaction declined. You're like, oh, I did screw up. But even if you get it right, it's like, eh, eh, eh. And you're like, was that good for you? Did you come? I'm not sure. Like, what's going on? Anyways, that's pretty much all I got for you because I forgot like five things. And, uh, <laughs> and next. Thank <laughs> you.